Hello everyone, my name is Daniel, also known as Chip, and welcome back to Minecraft. Now, uh, recently I've had a bit of confusion when it comes to my exploding arrows that I made a while ago. Well, that video was for around 1.8, possibly a bit earlier, so a lot's changed since then. We just totally wrecked that sheep. So all you need is three command blocks. If you don't know how to get yourself a command block, type in slash give at p and then c o m m press tab, press enter, and you will get a command block. Now a command block has three states. It has the impulse version, it has the chain version, and it has the repeating version. Now we're gonna use the repeating version and the chain version and not the impulse. So you're gonna go ahead and grab both of these and in your chat, you're going to type in scoreboard, objectives, add. Now I use arrow ground, like this. Uh, as you see, it's, it's uh, already a thing. Um, so, scoreboard, objectives, add, arrow, ground, with a capital A and a capital G, and make that a dummy, okay? So, now what we have is, in the first command block, this is just setting every arrow that hits the ground it sets their score to one so we have set all entities that are an arrow their arrow uh, their arrow ground score to one if they're in the ground now this tag at the end is very important otherwise it won't work it'll just make it so it explodes instantly so this you gonna you need to make sure you need to put this in okay everything will be down in the description so if you want it to just copy and paste it you can but now you're gonna make this repeating and always active, okay, and unconditional. The next command block, this is probably the easiest because it's more or less the same as the last one, uh, the last video should I say. So we're going to execute at all entities with a score of arrow ground minimum equals one. So in the last command block we just set every arrow that goes in the ground, their arrow ground score to one, so this is gonna execute this command at that entity. Now put in three tildes and you're gonna write summon prime TNT. And now you're gonna make this repeat and always active and unconditional again. And then in the next command block, oh also make sure these are pointing kind of into each other, these these two at the end. And this one you could put this one anyway. I could like literally put it there and it'll be fine. But anyway, now this next one we're just gonna kill any Entities with a score underscore arrow ground underscore minimum equals one square brackets um, You're gonna make this a chain conditional and always active so this only activates once this is activated so once it's exploded it'll kill the arrow and There'll be no more arrows around and it works really well like Ridiculously well. Oh, I just shot that sheep. <laughs> it doesn't work if you shoot the Thing you're trying to actually shoot at. You have to shoot cannon next to it. That's the only downside to this. But yeah, that was a really super easy video. Thank you for asking me to update this video. Um, and I'll see you guys next time. Oh, and also my Walking Dead video that I did. That's now on over 10,000 views, which is insane to me. It's my first ever video that hit anywhere near that amount of views. It's insane. So thank you for that as well. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching. Bye.